Yo, it's Lux from Server Pro, and welcome to this tutorial in which I'm going to show you how to install and use this uh, simple plugin called Double Jump. This plugin requires you to either be an operator on the server or have like a permissions plugin so that you can use the double jump. In this case, I'm going to be using permissions. The plugin I'm going to be using is called Permissions X, but you can use whatever permissions plugin you want. Once you have that, go to the link in the description. It's a spigot page where you can download the latest uh, version of the plugin. Click the download link, and after you've downloaded and saved the plugin on your PC, go back to the control panel, go to File Manager Plugins, and upload the file there. When the upload is complete, restart the server and you're done with the installation. As you can see, when I'm in game and when I toggle the double jump on or off, it doesn't actually let me double jump. This is because I haven't configured it correctly. So we're going to do that now. Go back to the control panel and then go into plugins, into double jump folder and open the config.yml. Here you can change everything about the plugin. The most important part is making sure your world is in the enabled in worlds list. My world name is flat underscore world, so I'm gonna write that. You can change the velocity, which is how far and how high you can jump. So the higher the number, the higher you can jump basically. You can enable and disable particles and sounds when the double jump is performed. All you have to do is either put true or false next to each statement. I'm going to keep them both enabled so I can show you what they look like. Okay, so to change the particles and sounds, go back to the main page of the plugin and open the two links here. On the first page, you'll see the sounds that you can use. All you have to do is basically copy one of them and paste it back into the config. Same applies with the particle effects, except of course use the other uh, link. For this one, I'm going to be using the explosion particles. The last thing I'm going to do is disable the remove full damage option because I want the player to take full damage if the double jump feature is toggled off. You won't take full damage when the actual double jump feature is toggled on, so don't worry about that. Apart from that, you're done with this config. Save and go to the permissions file. The only permission that you can use is called doublejump.use and you can find that on the spigot page. Once you've set up your permissions, save and restart the server to apply all the changes we've made. When you're in game, type in slash DJ toggle. This will enable and disable the double jump. As you can see, when I have it on and I press spacebar twice quickly, it double jumps. It's also playing the breaking glass sound and showing the explosion particle effects every time I do that. If you remember in the config, I've made it so that you can still take full damage if the double jump feature is toggled off. So yeah, that's why we take full damage. But when it's on, we don't take any full damage. So yeah, that's about it. I hope this tutorial was helpful. Thank you very much for watching and I'll see you in the next one. Goodbye.